It started with smiles and excitement. Nearly two dozen middle school girls from local Hillsborough County schools, all interested in a future in STEM, boarding this massive KC 135 to be a part of history in the making. It's a cool, interesting flight that not everyone gets the chance to do. Speaking with the only active female general in the Air Force, it was a once in a lifetime opportunity. Many of them talked about being scientists and engineers, going into robotics, wanting to be pilots. That's special. And with an all-female flight crew, the excitement was in the air. It's very inspiring for us, like young women who are trying to achieve our goals. With final checks complete, it was time for takeoff. Except this flight was a little shorter than scheduled. Instead of stopping in the Carolinas to refuel a C-17 like originally planned. She told me at first they were they saw some smoke coming out and nobody really understood what it was. Smoke was spotted in the back of the plane, forcing an unexpected detour back to base. One of the attendants came by her saw the smoke and then ran back and said, everybody put your mask on. Students were told to put on oxygen masks and disembark the plane on an inflatable slide. All right, guys, we're going to put our EMS on. Something they prepped for but weren't expecting. I got a call from my daughter as it was happening when she was going off the slide. Some parents were understandably upset. I was escorted off by a police officer from the visitation center because I demanded to see my daughter. They would not let me on the base. While others were hopeful, there might be another opportunity to try again. This was something that all of these girls wanted to do, and I think after the nerves settle, any one of them that you talk to will tell you they had a fantastic time. Elizabeth Fry, Fox 13 News.